The lion has forever been a symbol of strength, power, and ferocity. Learn more about these fierce and powerful cats with these lion facts. Let's get started. Lions are the second largest cat on earth. Only slightly smaller than the Siberian tiger, the lion is the second largest big cat, with a muscular, deep-chested body, short, rounded head, round ears, and a hairy tuft at the end of its tail. Unlike all other big cats that are solitary hunters, lions are social animals and live together in prides. Male lions can grow up to 10 feet in length and weigh up to 190 kilograms, while female lions can grow to a length of 9 feet and weigh up to 130 kilograms. They need this weight and power behind them to hunt large prey and defend their pride. Lions are the only cats that live in groups. A group or pride can be up to 40 lions, depending on how much food and water is available. Female lions are the main hunters. Despite this, the males eat first. While they're out looking for food, the males guard the pride's territory and they're young. A lion's roar can be heard up to 8 kilometers away. Lions scent mark their territory, using their wee, to create a border. Male lions grow impressive manes the older they get. These manes grow up to 16 centimeters long and are a sign of dominance. The older they get, the darker their manes go. As well as attracting females, their manes may also protect their neck and head from injuries during fights. Even though the lion is sometimes referred to as the king of the jungle, it actually only lives in grasslands and plains. The expression may have come from an incorrect association between Africa and jungles or may refer to a less literal meaning of the word jungle. Lions are highly adaptable and can live in very dry areas like the Kalahari Desert. Here they get most of their water from their prey and will even drink from plants such as the tsamamelon. Lions can eat up to 40 kilograms of meat in a single meal around a quarter of their body weight. Their tongues have sharp pointed rasps, called papillae, which are used to scrape meat off the bones. Lions can go up to four days without drinking water, but if available, they will drink water every day. Lions do need to eat every day. Adult female lions need to eat about 11 pounds of meat each day, while adult males eat 16 pounds or more every day. While lions primarily prey on large herbivores such as zebra, wildebeest, and buffalo, they have been known to prey on smaller animals like mice, birds, hares, lizards, and tortoises. Lions hunt by ambush. They hunt more during storms as the noise and wind make it harder for prey to see and hear them. Fanning out, they form a semicircle, with the smaller lionesses herding the prey towards the center. A lion's vision is roughly six times more sensitive to light than humans, giving them a distinct advantage when hunting at night. Lion's claws are retractable, reaching up to 8 centimeters in length, allowing for the tremendous control when it needs to go in for a kill. Lions can also reach speeds of up to 50 miles per hour in short bursts, and can jump up to 36 feet. A lion's heels don't touch the ground when it walks. A lion may sleep up to 20 hours a day. Most lions spend all their time on the ground, but in some parks across Africa they have learned to climb trees. Compared to leopards, they are not very graceful at climbing trees as they are not adapted for climbing. Most prides of lions do not climb trees and big males are less likely to climb a tree because they are so heavy. The reason why lions climb or sleep in trees is to get away from pesky biting flies and insects on the ground. It can be cooler up in a tree, and they have a higher vantage point to see if any other animals are nearby. Lions may also be forced to climb a tree temporarily to try to escape from an angered herd of buffaloes. A pride of lions is usually made up of related females and their cubs, plus a male or small group of males who defend their pride. The lionesses rear their cubs together and cubs can suckle from any female with milk. When they are born, cubs are very small and their eyes are closed until they are two to three weeks old. Even then, they cannot see properly for another few weeks. This is when they are vulnerable to attack from large birds, snakes, and even male lions. A lioness will keep her cubs hidden from other lions for around six weeks until they are old enough to follow the pride. 
Lion cubs are full of life and grow up playing with the other youngsters in the pride. They can be seen leaping, rolling, and gently biting. This type of play builds strength and family bonds. While the females usually live with the pride for life, the males often stay for only two to four years. After that they go off on their own or are evicted by other males who take over the pride. When a new male becomes part of the pride it is not unusual for him to kill all the cubs, ensuring that all future cubs will have his genes. The main job of males in the pride is defending the pride's territory. Lions are the only known cat species where individuals roar together with even young cubs joining in with their mews. The calling sequence usually lasts about 40 seconds. Prides often roar together to mark their territory a roar can be heard from 5 miles away. The lion was once found throughout Africa, Asia and Europe, but now exists only in Africa with one exception. The last remaining Asiatic lions are found in Sazangur National Park in India, which was primarily created to protect the species. Currently, there are approximately 350 to 400 lions in the park. In the wild, lions live for an average of 12 years and up to 16 years. They live up to 25 years in captivity. There are thought to be as few as 23,000 lions left in the wild. When you think there are around 415,000 wild African elephants, you realize lion numbers are incredibly low. In fact, lions have disappeared from over 90% of their historical range. The main threats are retaliatory or preemptive killing to protect people and livestock and decreasing natural prey and habitat, for example, due to expanding human settlements and therefore less available grazing. When their natural prey is scarce, lions can cause grave losses to livestock, which can destroy the income of local people. Climate change is another increasing threat. Extreme weather may cause more droughts or delay the rains, affecting lions' prey. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already.